And nearly a year after two Tryon town officials were arrested on federal charges, one of them is back behind bars. The former town administrator Joey Davis, former Commissioner Leroy Miller, were arrested after federal investigators say they were taking money from the town and paying personal bills. Our Brianna Smith has been on this story from the very beginning. She joins us now with the very latest. Brianna. Yeah, Gordon, court records show that Leroy Miller landed back behind bars on Monday for violating the conditions of his bond. In April of 2017, indictments for Joey Davis and Leroy Miller were handed down. They revealed an alleged agreement between Davis and Miller. As a city commissioner, Miller had power to sway other leaders to hand Davis a $5,000 raise each year in exchange for town money being used to pay Miller's bills. Davis was fired last January, just months before the charges, and Miller stepped down as commissioner last July. New documents are now being released by federal authorities showing Miller may plead guilty to his four charges in May. This factual basis for the guilty plea outlines the same set of allegations made last year. Today, Miller is back in handcuffs for violating his parole. And he's actually going to have an arraignment hearing on Friday for that violation of parole, and we'll find out more details there. So, so we don't know what he did to violate parole? No, because the court documents are sealed right now on the federal website, but hopefully on that Friday hearing we'll be able to find out that, and then back in court again in May for uh, the hopeful guilty plea on what he's posted online. Um, but so far we haven't heard anything about a plea for uh, Davis. Be, he'll stay in jail until that hearing on Friday, yeah. then, right? Okay, Brianna, thank you.